Hey everyone, welcome to episode 22 of Let's Platinum and, un and 100% Uncharted Drake's Fortune on the Uncharted Nathan Drake Club. Alright, let's continue. So I got a little cutscene here, and then we get my favourite gun, Wes. And not that, I wanted. Nope, give me the gun. Alright, so. Ooh, no, not that. Alright, this bit, let's see. I'm just gotta see enemies and take them out. Hey, he didn't die. How about that? <laughs> it's not the best section to be in here. Uh, hang on. Take that off, kick the door open. Now, I'm not really well protected, but I reckon if I just get a little bit close and try and locate some enemies. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ah, ah. What the hell even killed me? Okay, guys, here's the plan. Take the Wes. Take the... AK. Shoot the lock off the door. Oh, what? Oh my god. It didn't work. That never fails. Go out here. Go this way. Get behind this pillar. Take out these guys. Why does this guy take two bullets now? Brutal difficulty, I guess. Alright, those three are the only ones that come down, or so I've noticed. And then, okay, apparently this guy now too. Good. So he's gone. Now, when I did this last time, it was only three of them, not four. But then the rest are just kind of like waiting here. So there's this guy. That's what I wanted. Bullets. All right, there is only one guy left, and it's the guy behind the uh, the gun. So let's just get a little bit closer. Wait, and now take him out. Good. I think that's it. I think that's all the enemies. Yep. Judging by the music, it is all the enemies. So it's not actually a hard, too hard of a section. Um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue. However, uh, yeah, I want the PM9 for this guy. Oh, okay, that's no point in going up then. We'll stay with this 33 bullets. Alright, oh god, now we have the hardest section in the game. Oh, not like that. <laughs> I didn't think he was right, right there, but apparently he is. Maybe not the hardest section, but a hard section. Alright, so take him out like that. Uh, drop down here. Wasn't there a way I could get there? Hmm. Now, here's an issue. There is a guy... No, there is a man. A certain man. Uh, Alright, come on. There we go. That's what I wanted. So wait, what are you supposed to do then? Uh, oh, maybe you just leap to it. That'll work. Okay, so now we leap to this, leap to this, leap to this. Hope to God that I don't get killed by this guy. Oh! Oh, okay, I usually go the other way, but that works. Alright, so definitely do that. Grab the M79. I think it's better than the AK for right now, even though it's only got three bullets. We'll focus more on, like, just trying to blast some damage. Rather than, uh... Rather than being accurate. I don't know how much that's going to help, but we'll see. <laughs> okay, pick that up, pick that up. Alright, here we go, 37 bullets. Nice now, we've just got to over. just gotta remember the, uh, the pattern. So, there's this guy. Alright, well, it's going to take a while to get this right, so let's try. You want to get behind this pillar immediately, and just stay here. Take this guy out, if you can, like that. Take this guy out, and then this one, and then if you have enough time, quickly get ready with the M79 and fire over there, and just pray that that killed something. I don't think it did for me, but then take this guy out. Same with this guy, and the other guy is over there. Okay, so that works out, and then run over to this side. Get behind this pillar. Use the M79. Take both of them out, or at least one. And that guy. Get some health back. No, that's not gonna work. 
get him, and then we've got these final enemies, the shotgunners. They're gonna come from somewhere. Here we go. There. And then you gotta stand up at precisely the right moment. So like that. Take him out. Then do that, and you're good. <laughs> Just like that. Easy. That didn't take me 15 minutes to do. <laughs> no, it did take me 15 minutes to do. Um, okay, so obviously, you know, the first thing I need to say is that it might not work out. In fact, it almost certainly won't work out for you like it did for me. Um, you'll have to do it quite a few times to, to actually get it to work. Where did I kill those guys? I want the bullets. Oh, well, we'll skip it. Um... But yeah, it's just all about like constantly trying and trying and trying and trying and eventually you will get it. Um, but I think, yeah, the strategy at the beginning was solid. Uh, the sort of back end of the strategy is more um, luck based than, than uh, you know, skill. So it is a little, it's very, very tricky. You know, definitely don't underestimate it. It's extremely tricky. This is the next hardest chapter after chapter four, so, or at least so far. So yeah, just keep trying. It's brutal. That's what the you know the challenge is. It'll be really worth getting that gold trophy at the end. Okay, spam triangle. Now I'm gonna keep this in because I can't picture what the next area is. Did I get that right now? Um, so I'm gonna have to keep this in just to figure it out. I'm pretty sure there are more enemies really soon anyway, so that's why I'm not too worried about keeping it in. Alright. Climb up, climb up. That was really annoying. <laughs> oh well. I'm glad it didn't take as long as uh, previous sections, but it was still really difficult to get through. Once you get to the two shotgunners, if, you're, if your timing is good, then um, you should be fine. Remember just to let them fire one shotgun blast first, and then... Um, and then go for it. Alright, so where are we? I know this is the end of yeah, chapter 5. Now we've got 6, and this leads to where? Jesus, Elena, where are you? Oh, yeah, here, okay, yeah, there's more enemies oh, here anyway. Wait a minute. And then there's a bit of puzzle, and then more so enemies. Alright, here we go. This is pretty tough. It's very... The problem with this bit here... Oh, I shouldn't kill me. The problem with this bit here is there's so few... Well, there's only two enemies there. And then there's these guys. But obviously, even a few enemies are really dangerous and brutal. Okay, I got him. It's still not over. I think there's still some enemies. I'm gonna rush over here. I know that there's a, that cache of weapons back here. And then I'll figure out how to get up to the top. <laughs> uh, oh, a grenade that... Hmm. You know what? Let's try something. I don't believe there's any enemies there. Wait, I got an idea. Let's do this. Careful. Okay, run. Ah, <laughs> alright. Okay, guys, I'm back. Crouch down behind this, throw a grenade. Now, these two guys run here. Kill this first guy here, like that. The second guy. Nice. Alright, now for this bit. Run up here. Alright, a little bit further. Oh, it worked, it worked. Alright, so you want to run up there, up to that point, and then get back down here. That's what you want to do. And then you want to aim a grenade, just throw it up there. Take that guy out there. I don't know how many I've taken out, but... Well, I know I've taken out one. 
at the very least. And now, the tricky part. Run all the way back here. If you can get here safely, then you can have a little look. Just have a little bit of a glance around. This is the first time I've actually gotten this far. Oh! There we go. Ooh, okay, I got two now. Definitely got at least two, and I've unlocked a third guy there. That's three. Alright. Now the problem... Oh, I think I did it. Alright, thank god. <laughs> okay, that is a tough section, but if you do it the way I did it, um, it should work for you. Um, I'm going to explain a few things about it. Number one, you can... The reason why I came back downstairs is because what I was trying to do before was I was running up here, jumping up this little gap here. Actually, let me try that again. Jumping up here and hiding behind this box. But the problem was there was a guy there, there was a guy there, there was a guy there, and then the other guy, I guess, was like around somewhere back there. So that wasn't really working. Um, and not only that, but every time I jumped up here, there was like a 50 to 70% chance that I would die before I even got to this point. So, and I tried, I tried everything. Like I tried running up the stairs, hiding behind this, I died. Hiding behind this, I died. This was the, this actual little box here was actually the best the best thing, that, or the only one that really kept me alive, but it still wasn't good enough. So I decided to change tactics and run up the stairs, run back down the stairs, and then just try and get him. I don't know if I actually killed anyone with a grenade. Uh, no, I don't think so. I don't think really you need the grenade. I just threw it because I thought, well, maybe I'll kill something. <laughs> Alright, there's a little bit of puzzling. I just have to open that go through the gate, puzzle my way all the way back up through the tower, go down and then enter that door and then there's some more enemies, so I'm going to take care of that and then I'll be right back. Okay guys, we're back. Um, here's the next section. Um, it's, you know, you walk through here and then you fight all those guys in the really open section. It's a really hard bit, so it's going to take me a while. But, um, I'm going to have to stop. I'm sure I have plenty of time to do more in this episode, but I'm going to take a break for now and I will meet you in a few seconds, so I'll be right back. Okay, guys, we're back. I just checked. Um, got about uh, 13 minutes left in the episode, or to put into the episode, I should say. So that's good. This is going to be a tough section, and I have absolutely no idea how to go about it, but I will try my best. I think it's one of these walls that's good. I think that guy at the top. Here we go. Oh, that's a bad start. Just trying to get that barrel. Alright, let's just try being behind this pillar. It's very unlikely that the enemies can hit me from directly behind this pillar. So as long as I stay here, and pay attention to where they're coming from. Okay, should be good. I'm going to leave them for a little while. Okay, there's no one there. Oh, hello. Okay, good. Take him out. Stay behind the pillar. Oh, stay almost directly behind it. I, don't, I, all, I basically don't want to show myself at all to recover. Come on. Oh no. See, this is why I get confused. I am directly behind this pillar. There is absolutely no way anyone should be able to hit me. And yet they do. This is going okay though. If I can just kill that guy. There we go. It's him down. It's him down. Okay, no one over there. I believe there's one more on this side. And there are probably a few more. Oh, there we go. I think I'm slightly in danger. There we go. It's him. It's him. Alright, we've made good progress so far. I hear the music swelling. Alright, so... Oh, okay. Jeez, I didn't even know where I was aiming there. I was just hoping to hit something. And then, yeah, okay, there's another one. Good. Don't wanna die. Should've just waited. <laughs> right in the neck. Okay, head. Oh my god, I 
did that on my first go, no way. Alright. Oh, hang on. Music is still going on. I'm sorry, but how can you give me five bullets from someone that I killed with a brutal combo if it doubles the ammo that was originally in there? So that means the bullet, the, the gun had two and a half bullets. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to leave the PM 9mm because I believe we get another one soon. And I want to use the West to clear out the section at the top. Oh, look, there we go. There's one with 33 bullets. That's decent. Um, I think there's still one, like, later on. So I'm going to hold on to the West because I, I just... The West is just so good. Basically, if you if you take your time and aim, you'll, you'll get it. Alright. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's a checkpoint that I just got, so... Um, should be good for a little little while. For this, similar thing, um, stay behind this first wall and take them all out from here. Alright, so here they come. One, two, you basically don't even need to go for headshots here. Just hold off, just keep waiting. There's the shotgunner, most dangerous one of them all. He's good. That shotgun blast that I just took there, it shouldn't be able to kill you like it didn't for me. Wow, that was a poor miss. But uh, you obviously want to be very careful. It still did hit me even from that, that distance. Okay, that took a lot of bullets, but I didn't take damage, so I'm good. I think there's still a few more. There a guy over here. Yeah, there he is. I think that's the last guy. Oh, maybe not. There's the other guy. Good. Come on. First guy, first guy. Yeah, yeah. We're done. Please say we're done. I don't think we're done yet. I don't see anyone over there, but there's definitely more... more enemies. Where are you guys? Bet you is right around the corner. There's definitely more, the music is still going. Guys are so sneaky. Let's grab that. Alright, cool. Then I need to go back down. I'll collect the ammo in a bit. What the hell are these guys? Why is the music still going on? I'm so nervous because I, I just I made it this far in one go. And I don't want to fail. Are you serious? They've already... Oh, no! Hey! I was hiding! Where am I now? Am I... Oh, okay, I'm here. Okay, that's fine. Alright. <laughs> so this is... Yeah, alright. Let's see how this goes. Hmm. Whoa! What? Uh, alright. I guess I'll try and do it anyway. This is going to be extremely difficult. <laughs> The only reason I'm losing is because it was a poor start. Alright, here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. This guy, make sure he doesn't kill you. This thing pretty much has un unlimited bullets, so... Just... Go hog wild. Alright, we are finally done. Cool, I made it through that whole section with only dying... Twice, I believe it was? I think it was twice. But the only problem is now I can't collect any of the, the ammo that I needed. <laughs> oh well. It's not a big deal. Let's continue. Alright, so what's next? Um, is this the Elena bit or... 
I, I always forget. Like, I forget sort of uh, mini sections of the game, but for the most part, I remember. It's interesting cutting out all the sections where it's like just puzzle and stuff like that. Really, um, it tells me just how many enemies are actually in this game. There's so many. Like, I know that the shotgunner is going to come through that door now. And then I go where? Whoa, up there. Fletcher. I don't think so. to the great tower. I pray that you will meet us there. Francis Drake. Wow. So you made it. But what were you plotting? He was plotting some hotline bling. <laughs> Alright. That guy can be a pain. Uh... I, did I die to him in the original playthrough? I don't... I may have died to him in the original playthrough, but yeah. Um... That's... Yeah, I'm glad that I got him first go. Alright, now there's more enemies here. Uh... I wonder where I need to step to. Step, 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 to step, to. Let's try this. I never tried this strategy. Jump over here. <laughs> Alright, so that works. Must be Drake's tower. Now this is interesting. Alright, I'm gonna just test this theory. Okay, I don't think I can reach the other side. So let's try. I'll explain what my theory is momentarily if I can make it through this without dying. good. Might just be those three enemies. Micro, micro, AK-47. Uh, it doesn't really matter what I have now. Yeah, uh, my theory, which doesn't really matter here, it will matter later. Um, there are only a few sections in the game, in fact I think there's only one section in the game, apart from this one, because this is my theory, where, um, and I did it in the speedrun, you can skip sort of like entire sections by just going to the next um, area. So for example, there were three enemies there to kill, but if I had managed to get up to here uh, without dying and then just ran through... Oh, do I? How much puzzle do I have to do here? And then just ran through all of this section to get to the, the uh, next cutscene, I would have essentially been able to avoid the firefight. Now, the only reason I didn't was because A, uh, it would have been really difficult to get through, and B, there were only three enemies to deal with anyway, so it wasn't a big deal. But the um, the section where I skipped a whole bunch of stuff in... Oh, that is not what I meant to do. Damn. But the section where I skipped a whole bunch of stuff... Oh, beautiful. I think I actually died there before by accident um, in my first playthrough. But the section where I skipped a whole bunch of enemies during the speedrun, I will do that again, although I will have to probably kill a few like I did in the speedrun. Alright, I know why I'm falling there as well. Okay, so now we go up here. I would have cut that out, but I think uh, the next bit is the, um, the section with the car. Um, Alright, yeah, we got the... I, I have enough time for the car, at least. Oh, we have to wait for this. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be a tough section, but I'll finish the episode with that car sequence. <sighs> so what were you looking for, huh? I can't believe I got most of those on the first go. Alright, here we go. Skip the movie. Uh, kill him. Now we get another cutscene. Skip the movie. And now we go in the car. Alright. It's gonna be extremely difficult. I'm gonna die a million times. There's one. Alright, um, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cut to when I succeed. So like each time. Okay, getting somewhere now. Hopefully it turns out okay. Nope. <laughs> okay, we hit our first checkpoint, thank god. <laughs> 
that were back here. Um, this is still really, really tough. One thing that I didn't uh, take note of when I played this the fir first time again um, was that we actually get a refill on our grenades when we die. So you want to try and use that um, to your advantage. Wow, I'm surprised you can take down take down a lot of these trees. Like I'm actually shooting them and it, it's working. Please don't kill me now, please. All right, I might. I think I may have hit the next checkpoint. I'm really hoping I have, uh, but we'll find out. Okay, that was a good shot. Don't want to let these guys get too close. Good. Uh, isn't there a truck or something that goes by there? There we go. Yay, I got him. And come on, do I have a grenade left? I do, and I got him. I, I definitely hit the next checkpoint, I know that much. So now we're going alright. Ah, come on! Maybe I can still survive. Ha ha! What a shot. Hey, doing really well here. Died a few times to start off with. Who's shooting me? No! Ah, I'm alive, I'm alive. Uh, shoot. No, I'm gonna die here. Almost certainly. Oh my god, am I gonna make it? Am I gonna make it? Ah, <laughs> yeah, well, that's fine. Okay, cool. We're back here. Um, just keep trying. Da 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 die. Da 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 die. Blast that one. That's what I did wrong before. Kill those two. We're up to the cliff part. Uh, well, we're up to the first part of the cliff. Wait, wait. He said that. Can can you guys please die? Jeez, man. Alright, here we go. There's a cutscene. We're about 60% through this chapter, I think, now. Alright, let's keep going. Take this guy out with the grenade. And then now we're gonna go this way. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Damn. That, was, that wasn't even my fault. That was because the camera changed so much. But yeah, it puts us in a good position for the next bit. Actually doing fairly well considering this is on brutal. I think I've died ten times maybe? Ten or eleven. Come on, ah, this guy. Oh what? How did I die? That doesn't make any sense. Alright, looks like I have one grenade left. Alright, uh, yeah, this bit here is really tough, um, there's a guy on the right here, and a guy on the left, ah, uh, okay, I think I finally got it, please, please, alright, I think I finally got it, that's the hardest bit, um, well, that entire section, and I really hope I have hit a checkpoint by now, because I do not want to do that again, please tell me I hit a checkpoint. Yeah, surely by now. Alright, thank god I have... I think they give you a grenade there. I ran out of grenades before. That was the thing I wanted to say. Oh. I, for some reason I ran out of grenades and now apparently I still have them. Alright. Where are we? We better not be back there. Alright, good. Thank god. Um, yeah, the section I did before was like a glitchy... not glitchy, but just unfair mess. Okay, we're back. This... <laughs> this chapter really sucks. This is like literally an, uh, just a mess. It's, it's very unfair, it's very all over the place. Whether you win or lose. Oh, I finally made it, thank god. Um, yeah, it's just really unfair. <laughs> I, I don't know how, how to describe it any better. There are sections that are going to kill you over and over and over again, you're going to think, how the hell am I supposed to get past? But just, like, keep trying and you'll eventually get there. Alright, and now we're here, and now we skip movie, and now we're here. 
Alright, so I'm going to pause the game here and end the episode. But first let me quickly get to this next bit. Alright, we're going to stop right here. Um, okay guys, thanks for watching episode 22 of Let's Platinum and 100% Uncharted Drake's Fortune on the Uncharted Nathan Drake Collection. My name is Ultimo456 and I'll see you next time.